Tonight in 7 News Flashback, Monorail Mania. Queensland was the home of Australia's first high-tech people mover back in 1986 when they were on the verge of taking over the Gold Coast. Rod Young reports. Look around, the day is just beginning. Queensland's first monorail was at SeaWorld. Premier Joe Bielka Peterson was hooked. There wasn't enough room for all the invited guests on the 100 capacity train that made the inaugural journey around SeaWorld's rapidly expanding attractions. So when planning Expo 88, it had to have one. This is the Swiss factory where the Expo monorail will be built. Make no mistake, it was from Switzerland. Our Swedish friends, the uh, one roll Abaga people, have won the tender. But the Swedish people, you rep represent them, sir. Uh, I'd like you to thank them. Correction. Uh, uh, a sweet, uh, Swiss, yes, not Swedish. <laughs> <laughs> Expo 88 monorail opened four months early, allowing Queenslanders to get their first views of Expo even before the site was finished. This was the view of Brisbane as the monorail glided along Southbank. The following year, in 1989, Queensland's third monorail opened. At $1 a ride, hundreds of shoppers queued for takeoff. The $10 million monorail travels almost silently through the new Oasis shopping centre across the Gold Coast Highway to Jupiter's Casino. The Queensland government was just warming up with huge plans. The Gold Coast monorail will have stations at Southport and SeaWorld, with the service meeting at Main Beach and running to Pacific Fair at Broad Beach. We've got the greatest concentration of monorails here in South East Queensland compared with anywhere else in the world. But the coast plan was met head on with protests organised by Kerry Smith. And they are the people who are going to be directly affected by this monstrosity. People power defeated the people mover. The Expo monorail vanished after the event. The Oasis monorail was closed in 2017. Sydney axed its system. Now the only one left is SeaWorld, the very first. Currently, it's shut to allow for construction of Atlantis. The park adamant the monorail will reopen mid next year. Take the ride of the life we see.